Yo, March 8th, about 647. Uh, how's everybody going? I am in a great mood. This is my first day of rehab. Uh, inpatient rehab, I'm in my room. Uh, show you what I got there. Got my walker, got the bed. I'm out of the bed, uh, cabinet and stuff. Bathroom, I shut the door because I talk a lot. And I'm currently in a wheelchair. I have free access to the wheelchair. I can get out of that bed. Uh, looks pretty goofy. Then I get to this walker. And then I get from that walker to this uh, wheelchair. And we're getting there. So I'm really excited. Today, uh, three hours of uh, PT, physical therapy, occupational therapy. I still don't understand the difference. But uh, yeah, I was going. I went outside. They had me in the uh, wheelchair basically using just my feet. If you can see my feet. I can kind of control them. Hopefully you can see this. See, I can't really spatially recognize where they are, but I can kind of do it, see? So then I was using my feet to actually, oh, I'm not supposed to bend over, to actually walk up and down these, uh, I'm locked, I think the wheels are locked. To walk up and down these, these slants for wheelchairs but with just my feet so um kind of look bad uh, i did get to take a shower it's a shower chair in there pretty sexy right but i got to sit in a shower and take a shower and wash uh, i need to shave uh yeah i feel super good i'm uh after surgery it's been almost a week tomorrow will be a week since surgery uh, i was about one percent better for three days then about 2% better, and now I'm like 5% better every day. I feel super great. Um, I wanna get out next week. I don't know if that's possible. Some of the exercise I saw to do is to extend your leg and do this. I'm like 70%, like I can't really feel it. Like if you would bend my toes, I wouldn't know which way my toes were going. But this is just to get the, the they call it proprio, I always forget something I'll think of something it's not knowing where your feet are so I can tell by looking but if I don't look my feet get stuck on the wheel or this or that so like if I put pressure down right now I could stand up but I don't feel my legs literally bending and pushing me up it's like watching a robot very strange but I'm getting there and uh, Kelly's on the way to visit my sister uh, I had chicken fried steak tonight and mashed potatoes and gravy and corn and I get full work use of the facility. They have a mock-up, I think I mentioned, of a, an apartment where you can get in and get out of a tub. I might be moving from upstairs at my sister's house to downstairs, so I don't have to navigate stairs. Uh, the GoFundMe thing's amazing. It's the first time I talked about it without crying. You guys are just, it's, it's, it's a godsend. It really helps with some of these stupid expenses I'm gonna have to get. I have to buy a grabber, one of those long grabbers that your grandma used to grab something out of, off of uh, you know, like a shelf or something. Uh, if they're getting me a wheelchair, I gotta buy a walker. Uh, they'll pay for some stuff, they won't pay for other others. Uh, I wanna get back to work just because I wanna do something. I deliver a wholesale food and I lean down in coolers and I gotta get me out of a van. So next week might be a little early, but if I can get out of here by next week and then continue to exercise at home, maybe I can get, you know, I don't wanna lose that job. It's easy money, it's 3 a.m. to 3 p.m. It's where I did most of my blogs from. Uh, this is really healthy for me to do, so I feel good. Uh, I'm not gonna keep this real long. I just wanted to tell you guys that thank you for everything. I'm blown away. Uh, never in the thought I had this many friends. <laughs> I'm doing it again. Wow. Anyway, I'm super happy. Uh, go Eagles, bitches. Deuces.